All right, guys. Marco will outdo himself today. All right. So I'm just going to set the camera angle here better. All right. That's a better angle. All right. So Marco will outdo himself today. And, of course, he always outdoes himself. And that's why you have so many good videos of mine uh, to look at. Um, I'm really, 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 really good. So if you haven't seen me yet, um, you will like my stuff for sure. Now check out the good videos. Some of the videos honestly are bad, right? Because I've got 9,300 videos. So some of them are bad. I don't think any of them are bad, but if you watch them, you might not be like, this is wow, why is, why is he performing? If you see the ones that are really wow, you'll be like, okay, this is really, really, really good. He's an amazing performer. That goes with every channel. You can't have perfect videos every time. But I have to remind people just to make sure that if they're watching my channel, they know, yes, some of my videos are flawless. Some of them are really, really good. And you're like, holy, this guy can be the best singer in the world. And some of my videos are like, okay, he's got a scratchy voice, not singing the words properly. This could be the worst thing I've ever heard. So, you know, you have that to gamble with when you're looking at my videos. But... But you're going to see some really phenomenal ones if you look around, okay? Sometimes the first video you see is phenomenal because we've got quite a few phenomenal ones. All right, so that goes without saying. All right, now that I'm, now that I'm telling you, it goes without saying. Um, so anyway, I'm going to perform for you guys. So Melina's going to do a costume day for you guys, okay? So in the costume day, she's going to be... Um, she's going to be a Navy officer. She's going to be a police officer. She's going to be, um, she's going to be a celebrity. She's going to be, um, what else is she going to be? She is going to be a celebrity, uh, and there were some other costumes. I just don't remember which ones they were. I've got some listed. I, I, I don't remember exactly. I'm not exactly sure. I think there's at least one more costume I'm thinking. Um, oh, a cyborg uh, female robot or cyborg Barbarella or whatever you want to call her. So she's going to do all those today, okay? So just to make sure you have something really good to enjoy. All right. And, of course, Marco is going to perform. Now, he's going to do some requests. So there weren't as many requests. I think people know I'm going to go back to work soon, so they didn't want to give me too many requests. But you can keep them coming. Try not to overload me with them now that I'm going to go back to work soon. Uh, but um, you can keep them coming. I'm not getting paid on YouTube now. If you want me to always do tons and tons of requests and always do what you, uh, you always do tons and tons of videos, please get me subscribers faster. That way I can get viral on YouTube and then I can have a channel that gets paid. And then once I get paid more and more, the more I get paid, the more I don't have to work as much as the other jobs. And then I can focus just on this. And then you'll see tons and tons more. All right. So that's, that's what I would say up to you guys. But you guys are already doing a really good job. You guys are amazing. A lot of you subscribe. A lot of you are, a lot of my, a lot of my fans are genuinely really good people with ambition and that are striving for ambition. Now, I don't know exactly all my fans. Like, I, I know I've, I've got them to sign up or whatever. I usually, I usually tell a lot of them to subscribe. But um, when I when I meet my fans, they seem like really strong people. Like, I know some accountants. I know some people that are doing really well in school. I know some people that have good careers. So it's really good to see that my channel is a really intellectual channel not intellectual, but for intellectuals that like to do really good entertainment. And, you know, I'm an intellectual outside of music. In music, I, I think I am a very intellectual intellectual person uh, because I can come up with titles like that. I can come up with songs, uh, song ideas and video ideas very, very quickly. But in terms of my intellect, I'm also very intelligent. I have a de two degrees as well. Very intellectual, so... I really think that's great, and I, I, you know, one thing that I, I've noticed in TV recently is Kim Kardashian is taking a law school. Now, that normally isn't that great, I mean, you would think that's not that great, but Kim Kardashian does not have to go to law school, and she's doing law school, so I'm really excited for her, because that's a really good thing to choose. If you're that rich, you don't have to do anything, you don't have to do anything at all, but she's decided to take up law school, so really good on her. I uh, really appreciate celebrities that are 
actually striving to better themselves. I mean, you know, for me, I, I'm not a celebrity yet. I'm not famous enough to call myself a celebrity. I look like a celebrity. I have performances like a celebrity, but I haven't gone viral. So, so I think I will, and I think I'm worthy of that status. But to, but to see Kim Kardashian actually do that is quite impressive. I'm really pleased. You know, I'm really grateful that I have an education. I was very fortunate to have that. Um, so to me, it's something that I've always been proud of. Uh, my mom was really strong in, in making sure that all of us kids in our family had an education. So I'm really grateful that we all did. Um, so I'm really good, uh, really good there. So I'm really glad for Kim Kardashian. That's awesome. She's gonna do well, I'm sure. Uh, anyway. So today with the performances, the performances will be hot. They'll be sizzling. They'll be amazing. They'll be really, really good. I'm in great shape, as you can tell. And this is all natural. No liposuction. No, no, uh, no, no, no plastic surgery whatsoever. Uh, even if I'm a rich, rich celebrity and I'm 80 years old, I'm not going to do plastic surgery. I don't believe in it for myself. Now, I think, I think some plastic surgeons do a really good job. Some people are not able to look as good as they look. And some do botch up the surgery. That does happen in surgeries. Some surgeries get botched. But for the most part, a lot of plastic surgeons are very, very good at their jobs. And they, um, well, I don't know. I never had it. But, um, but if you research the plastic, make sure to research the proper plastic surgeon. Because uh, some do botch it up, so you want to make sure it's not botched. Um, but... Um, but for the most part, I think it's a good thing, you know, to, uh, to be allowed to have plastic surgery when, when, let's say, you have some flaw that could easily be fixed and you're very annoyed with it and it's an actual flaw, so it's something that you think is a flaw. But let's say you have maybe, maybe something with your nose. I always go to the nose because I think, you know, if your nose is really, really big and awkward looking and the rest of you looks perfect, well, how fair is that? You know, I'm very lucky. My my whole body, my whole face is perfect, so I don't need to worry about that. But if I was some the same person with a big, big nose, much bigger than this, and it was awkward, well, of course, plastic surgery would be for me because I I mean, I would love it because why not? You know, I don't want to have a big, big nose that's unusually big when I don't have to. You know, and of course plastic surgery for people that can afford it, but uh, but if you are able to earn that money, and you earn that money yourself, then of course, why not? If you have a flaw that's actually an actual flaw, then why not, you know? So it's important that you, it's, it, we're very, very lucky to live in a society, in Canada and the U.S. especially, uh, mostly I'm assuming, uh, that you can go to a surgeon to fix a flaw that you wouldn't otherwise be able to fix. Now. Uh, no, it's, it's something that's very, very, um, it's, it, it speaks volumes about how we live as Canadians and Americans, you know, we have, we have access to all this technology, access to everything at our fingertips, even people that are not, not extremely well off can do quite well, so it's quite, kind of nice, you know, uh, if you have no money whatsoever, well, that's awful, but, if you have enough money to get by and have a computer, you have access to enough stuff that you're able to do quite well. Uh, you're able to get a career, you know. Uh, you have people looking for careers with you, kind of like employment agencies, all that. So you're very, you're very, very fortunate to be a Canadian American, just so you know, all right? Okay. So anyway, today's performances will be really, really good. I'm going to do some covers now, or some requests now, okay? So not right now, but in the next set of videos. So in those requests, I'm going to do some songs. Now, I didn't get too many requests, which is fine. Um, I don't mind because I mean, then I can pick songs for the rest of it. But if you want to give requests, don't be shy. If you have never given a request and you want to give a request, do so. Do so. If you're someone that's seasoned at giving requests and you love every single request they come out with, do so as well. So I know some people have regularly said requests. So if you want to do another request, you can. You don't have to, but if you want to. Um, now, I'm very, oh yes, you know I'm very, very good. So anyway, Craigie, if you want to give a request, more than one, that's totally fine. My vacation is still going on for a bit, so I can do a lot of requests if you want to do like 10 or 20, I can do 10 or 20. Okay, 
So enjoy, guys. Thank you very much. All right. Bye now.